please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning and welcome to The Morning Show. Today is Monday, November 20th, 2017, and D-Day. Good morning, I'm Nick. Anyone interested in the five-hour pre-licensing class, please register online at websterscentral.revtrack.net. The class will be held tomorrow from 3.30 to 8.30 in room E3. The cost is $52. Attention girls in grades 10 through 12. We are pleased to announce a Perry Outreach Program in Rochester, New York, which will take place at the University of Rochester School of Medicine and Dentistry on February 17, 2018. We will be holding our POP event for high school students in the Rochester area. Women in grades 10 and up interested in exploring careers in orthopedics or engineering are encouraged to apply. In addition to six hands-on mock surgical exercises, participants will hear lectures from local women surgeons and engineers. We are accepting online applications for this event until the application deadline of January 17, 2018. There were flyers posted on the bulletin boards in the cafeteria. Attention advanced placement students, it's not too late to register for AP exams. To avoid the possibility of a late fee, please hand your form and money into Mrs. Newman by December 1st. If you have any questions, please see Mrs. Newman or Mr. Sepka in W29. Barnes & Noble Book Fair is this week. Support our PTSA by making a purchase on Sunday, November 26th from 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. in store or online. We're also looking for student volunteers to provide an extra set of hands or musical entertainment during the event. See Mrs. Law in W29 for volunteer details or visit websterptsa.org slash Schrader for more details. Congratulations to Speech and Debate Team for a second place finish Saturday at Harley. Buffalo City Honors edged us out 70 to 71 and we beat McQuay by two points with 10 schools competing. High scorers were Robbie Billings and Viknesh Beskar for first in varsity public forum debate, Julia Coffey for first in varsity oral interpretation, and Luke Stoll for second in declamation. Luke tied for first in ranks, and the tie was broken by speaker points. That's it for me, and that's it for the morning show. Have a great day, Schrader. Hi, I'm Leah. And I'm Tanya. And we're lucky enough to be studying computer science. Hi, I'm Tanya. We think it's terrible that 90% of schools don't teach it. They definitely didn't offer it at my high school. Thanks, thanks. So we're trying to make this video to show that anybody can learn. We want to get 10 million students to do the Hour of Code. Hour of Code. Hour of Code. The Hour of Code. Hour of Code. Hour of Code. Hour of Code. How do you get him to get to the sunflower? He needs to do some actions. I got it. <laughs> hey. oh. And then we'll run it and see what happens. Uh, <laughs> amazing. Ah, there we go. You just wrote your first program. I wrote it? Yeah. Oh. yeah. <laughs> this is the code that you just wrote. Very awesome. I thought like code was like FBI hacker symbols and stuff. <laughs> a little bit of problem solving, a little bit of logic. It's like instruction. Programming is a lot easier today. Don't just play on your phone. Program. All right. Awesome. How does someone go about getting a job? Maybe take an online class, find a class at a community college. You can get one of the best paying jobs in the world. I think medicine's moving into the whole computer age. Technology touches every part of our life. If you can create technology, you can change the world. So we're excited that you are participating in today's Hour of Code. We just did two lines of code. Three lines of code. Four lines. Seven lines. Five lines. Five lines. Sixty lines of code. Ninety-nine lines. Sixty lines. Eighteen lines of code. Seventy-five lines of code. Doesn't matter how old you are. Todos lo pueden hacer. The hour of code. 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 Whether you're a young man or a young woman, whether you live in a city or a rural area, everybody in this country should learn how to program a computer. And I just completed the hour. Code. It's actually really easy to learn. Girls should learn this too. Understand that language that's going to be the, the future. Anyone can learn computer science. And you can learn too. Jack Dorsey, Mark Zuckerberg, Bill Gates, all of y'all, I'm learning. Give it a shot. Here, now they can't tell me nothing. We give that to the people. Spread it across the country. Labels out here, now they can't.
tell me nothing. We give it to the people, spread it across the country.